my name's Laura Lucero. I'm an activist in Albuquerque, New Mexico, and I'm very pleased to share a statement prepared by Senator Eric Riego in support of the Occupy movement and the move to amend. Um, and unfortunately, he was not able to be here with us today at Yale Park. But here's Eric Riego's statement. I am thrilled by the passage of Senate Memorial 3 along with House Memorial 3 sponsored and passed by our stale wart progressive from Representative Mimi Stewart. New Mexico is now only the second state in the nation to call on Congress to send the states a constitutional amendment to reverse Citizens United. I commend Senator Steve Fishman for his leadership in introducing the memorial and which I was very proud to co-sponsor. I congratulate Move to Amend Common Cause Center for Civic Policy, Progressive Democrats of America, Progress Now New Mexico, the Occupy Movement, and other wonderful progressive organizations and activists who have worked tirelessly to stand up for our democracy and try to get the corrosive influence of corporate money out of politics. The passage of Senate Memorial 3, while something to be celebrated, is only a start. We need to do more to get money out of politics. And what does that mean? First, we need to support these groups and activists in their important work, not only in New Mexico, but also in other states. New Mexico is a leader on this issue, but we can't do it alone. We're going to need other states like Wisconsin, Colorado, Massachusetts, California, and so on also to get on board. Second, we need to encourage our members of Congress and support legislative efforts to start the constitutional amendment process. Let's make sure to keep organizing and to let our congressional champions and allies know that the people have their backs for doing the right thing. And third, ultimately, I believe the only real solution to getting the influence of money out of politics is to pass public financing of elections at all levels. The current system forces candidates to spend too much time trying to raise money, which takes time away from their time to talk with voters and with constituents about their ideas, values, and issues that matter to them. I was proud to sponsor and pass voluntary public financing in Albuquerque city elections when I was a city councilor. But we need your help now. It may not happen but we, right now, but we need to keep the fire alive. Finally, thanks to those who supported my amendment to Senate Memorial 9. That was to ask all out-of-state corporations to pay their fair share. I'm happy to see this modest progress. It's a start, but it's still absurd that we're asking teachers to pay more for their pensions, but we don't have the political will to ask out-of-state corporations to pay more. I look forward to continuing to work to close corporate tax loopholes. Thank you. Let's enjoy these victories, and let's keep organizing to win more victories. You know what Citizens United, oh wait, excuse me, <laughs> Citizens United is? Um, yeah, well, it's a uh, ruling by the Supreme Court which allows for um, unrestricted uh, funding for uh, electoral candidates on behalf of corporations. Uh, well, I believe we can't label corporate uh, entities as people, obviously, and that money can't be part of the sway in politics. That's a big, big task. That's the big task. So how do we deal with this thing? Right. Do we tear down the government? Do we burn it all up? Do we use policy in Washington? It's probably a uh, multifaceted Or do we just run around yelling approach. stuff at people? Which, what, a, little what, bit of a, a little bit of all of it. Maybe not so much the burning down government thing, because okay. the whole terrorist I was just saying that thing, to be funny. But sure. Okay, cool. Um, I think we should just keep on showing up, keep on, you know, signing petitions, lobbying our politicians, becoming active in local government first and foremost, and um, demanding that our representatives actually represent us. Us. Um. Forest, Hill of Ghost Green Water. Yes, I am. Nobody lives. Nobody lives.
can ever stop me as I go walking down Freedom's Highway. Nobody's living can make 